Hey Pisces, thank you so much for checking out my channel for the love of water tarot. My name is Keonti and I'm going to bring us a love read. Again, this is going to be for the Pisces, the baby shark, sun, moon, rising, and Venus. If you're cross-watching, it can resonate from your perspective. This energy and these are general messages won't resonate for every Pisces on the planet. Keep what resonates for you, release what doesn't. If I get it right for you, please make sure you give me the like, comment, subscribe, and the share. And if you guys are interested in booking me for a private read, my email information is in the description box below. All right, done. Lesson learned. Soulmate. Uh-oh, Pisces. That doesn't have to mean that you guys are breaking up, but I definitely feel like there is some sort of cycle that is closing out here with you and a soulmate. Similar friendship, romantic partner. This could be a friend. This could be a lover. But there's something that's done, completion, and a lesson learned here. Again, this doesn't have to be a complete breakup, but whatever's happening here, whatever cycle's going on with you and a soulmate, there's been something that is now over, right? Lesson learned, and it's dealing with soulmates here, Pisces. Put it where it goes. Like I said, it doesn't have to be that you guys are completely breaking up, but there is some sort of completion happening here, okay? Give me more for the baby sharks. Give me more for Pisces spirit. Make the messages plain for me. What's going on with Pisces? Meeting. Two or more people, discussion, planning. Okay, so there is there is some sort of completion happening here, but then I have a meeting. I have a, some sort of meeting with two or more people here to have discuss discussing and planning. And what's this? TikTok, deadline, time running out. So listen, Pisces, maybe there's something time sensitive happening here with you on a soulmate, right? Maybe you guys got to get something done or accomplish, and you're trying to figure out how to do it, right? Some of you are giving somebody. A deadline. The time is running out on a situation here, right? Some of you are in this energy where, like, if we can't figure this out or get this done or get this completed, then I'm done, right? For some of you, this is a conversation. This is two or more people working together to get something done, to get something accomplished because there's something about a deadline, something time sensitive here, okay? Give me more for the Pisces. Give me more for the baby shark spirit. Denial, not facing the truth, irrational reasoning, pop up. <laughs> Pisces, we always keep it. We always keep it interesting, don't we? Yeah, Pisces, it feels like however this is going with you and a soulmate. Like I said, this could be a friend, this could be a lover, this could be the people you work with. However, this is going, <clears throat> I feel like there's getting ready to be a complete completion to a cycle. Right? It feels like. A discussion is happening here about it. I feel like probably some of you are having some sort of discussion and somebody just don't want to see the truth. They don't want to face it. That They're denying it, right? They're denying something. Or Pisces, you are flat out going to deny someone and be done with something here. If someone doesn't face the truth, yeah. Pisces, I feel like some of you are trying to get someone to see things clearly, right? You're trying, you're like, you're trying to, it's definitely about some sort of completion right some sort of cycle closing out and lessons being learned i feel like there's this conversation coming in right or there's two people that's trying to plan and get something on the same get, get on the same page because something is time sensitive pisces i feel like if someone doesn't get on the right page with you if they want to be in denial they don't want to face the truth then like you're done right like I, I did what i could do right for sure this could have already happened you could be already be like i did what i could do to help can't help anymore right give me one more for this for the baby sharks Give me one more for Pisces for this. Give me one more for Pisces spirit. Make a plan for me. That soulmate card wanted to flip out again. <laughs> Give me another one for Pisces. Just one more spirit. What do we need to know about this situation? Family. Blood ties. Inner circle. And then the pop-up is up here again. Okay. So I feel like something, something unexpected came up, right? Something spontaneous. Something unexpected happened here. Dylan... Dealing with you and a soulmate. But I feel like something, there's some sort of completion to this, right? Some of you, it's like someone could definitely not want to face the truth about their family, their inner circle. Like, for real. Like, literally, some of you could be trying to get someone to see something, right? Yeah, I do feel like there's someone who doesn't want to see the truth about a family situation. I feel like you could be trying to get someone to see the truth, right? But they don't want to see it, right? They're denying it. So it's like, well, you, I did all I can do, Pisces. That, that, that could be how you feel about the situation. I did all I can do, right? I also feel like for some of you, like, this could be something that you're trying to get your partner to realize is time sensitive, right? For de dealing with you and the family. Like, we got to get this accomplished and done. And somebody could be like, 
him and Han denying, not facing the truth, or they got irrational reasons, you know, why something won't work. I do feel like there is an energy of something dealing with like family, blood ties, and inner circles here, right? For sure. Let's go ahead and get some clarification on this, baby sharks. Let's see what this what's what's this done is about. What is this cycle that's completing here and this lesson being learned? This is the world energy. Let's see what this is about. Official person flip. One more flip to poverty. Yep. Okay. Courthouse. This that justice energy. So listen, there could just be a cycle uh closing out with you and your uh your person. It doesn't feel like it's necessarily like you know extreme here, right? But I do feel like you're trying, Pisces, you're trying to get someone to learn some sort of lesson or you're learning some sort of lesson about a person. It could be, you could, some of you are definitely dealing with an air sign or a Libra. Some of you, you got like, you, some of you definitely cut off your official person. You left them in the cold, like karma, justice here. But it doesn't have to be that extreme. I feel like some of you are just trying to get someone who you care about to learn some sort of lesson here, right? About karma and justice, about doing the right thing. Give me one on this meeting for Pisces. Two or more people. It's a discussion and a plan here, right? Give me one for this meeting for Pisces. A mature man. So there's a mature man at this meeting. <laughs> Possibly this could be someone you have a child with, right? Child. This could be a man child. There could be a man child here. <laughs> but I feel like there's some sort of meeting more than anything. Like planning about some sort of new beginning. Pisces, I feel like you're like I feel like Pisces, I feel like you're kinda ahead of someone, right? You've already learned some lesson that you're trying to get someone else to learn, right? For sure. And then here's the child. So there's something about a new beginning, starting all over, planning something, planning something in the baby phase is here. Give me one for the denial. Why is someone not facing the truth, having this irrational? Pisces, some of you could have had a kind of could have got up with some people in your family, friends, however it went. You got up with some people, and you realize these are not your kind of people anymore, right? <laughs> oh no! Give me some for denial. I see that as well. Some of you could have met up with a man, a mature man, or however this is going, and you could have realized, like, no, marriage, partnership. See, I feel like hmm, journey. Pisces, I feel like in some way, shape, form, or fashion, someone here doesn't want to see the truth about a, about a partnership here, right? Mm-hmm. Someone could be on the defense if they don't want to, they, like, for sure. Pisces, for some of you, you cut someone off. I'm, I, I hate to be messy, but it's true. You cut someone off because they didn't want to see the truth. If, if they were in another situation, they, did, they didn't want to see the truth about the situation, right? You, you just, I feel like you could have told someone, like, leave this, leave this person alone. And this doesn't have to be... Okay, let me say it like this. A couple things I'm seeing. For some of you, there is something about a third party, right? Someone doesn't want to see the truth about the relationship they're in. So you're done, right? You tried, tried to get on the same page with them. You tried to make them understand that whatever they were in may not have been so good. Denial. They didn't want to take the, 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 uh, the rose-colored glasses off of it. So you're like, F it, right? Third party shit, right? But for others of you, it's not necessarily that. I feel like... You could be dealing with someone, a friend, a family member, however it is. This is somebody who's going through some shit that you've already been through, right? And you're trying to get someone to see the truth here, right? I don't know. This could be your friend. She could be in a bad relationship with a man. This could be a man, and you're trying to get him to see the, 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 the truth about a situation. But I feel like on some way, shape, form, or fashion, someone doesn't want to take the rose-colored glasses off about a partnership that they're in. And here's the journey. Something about a trip, travel, or change. Why is family here? blood ties in our circle. Pisces, some of you, this could be just a family member that you've been trying to get to see, right? That doesn't want to see the truth, right? Let's see why family, blood ties, in our circle is here for Pisces, the baby sharks. Any more for this? Any more for this energy for Pisces? Clarify this energy. There's a wealthy man, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, and another one flipped out change oh the chariot energy and look there's that mature man again now listen you have to put it where it goes because i, I just clear i just uh channel energy but i do have a mature man and a wealthy man here so i have masculine energy in the building for sure there is a masculine energy here there's something either going on about a car a trip or a move someone could definitely travel for work right wealthy man and change someone travels right 
But there, I, I feel like there's something about this wealthy man and family, right? He could have blood ties to something, something about family. Someone could, like, like, like some of you could just be simple as, it could be just, um, as simple as if you and your partner is at a distance, right? And there could be like a, a back and forth, pull, pull, push or pull or tug of war about who's going to come to who, right? Because he could have family where he is. You could have family where you are, right? So it's like we can't get this partnership together until we can face the truth that we got to actually be together to be together, right? For sure. It could be just that simple, Pisces. But for others of you, it's some of this other stuff I said. You'll hear the beautiful sounds of Chicago in the background. Don't judge me. <laughs> Let's get some clarification on this. I do see it, though. Pisces, like I said, for some of you, you could be trying to get a friend or a family member to see the situation that they're in. It's no good and they need to get out of it, right? But it's it, but it's like you maybe you can't right or maybe you will because I do see a wealthy man here making some sort of change, could be moving traveling. I feel like some of you maybe you pulled the rose colored glasses off of someone about a situation that they was in right. Hmm. All right, baby sharks. Let's go ahead and get some more clarification. Again, guys, like, comment, subscribe, and share if I got it right. Email me if you're interested in booking me. I'm going to try to get some other signs done today. Um, I definitely have requests for Aquarius. I'm going to try to do Aquarius. I'm going to try to get Libra done. I'm also going to try to do Capricorn. If there's some others that you guys would like for me to do, make sure that you comment, and I'll, and I'll try to get them done today. All right, baby sharks. Let's see what done a fishy person in poverty is. There's definitely, this is just the world. This is a cycle closing out and big lessons being learned here, right? And for some of you, it is like you're leaving your, you, you're leaving your official person in the past. Or someone is learning a lesson, you, like someone has learned the lesson that was in a situation and they're leaving that in the past. Give me some for Pisces for this. What is this official person in poverty going uh, here about for the baby sharks? Justice could be dealing with the Libra. Yep, but something is getting ready to be over. This could be a legal contract. Here's the Six of Cups. So there's definitely an energy dealing with children, fond memories, childhood, past time, past love. For sure, something here about a, about about a soulmate connection. And remember, remember, soulmate was underdone in the first place. Could be dealing with the Libra, another water sign. What's under the Six of Cups, the High Priestess? Pisces, intuitively, you know something here, the High Priestess, the Queen of Cups. This definitely has something to do with you, your intuition, what you know, what secrets you may be keeping. Someone could be secretly feeling this way about you. You may not even know that someone from your past is leaving their official person, getting some sort of divorce. Well, look what's under here, Death and the Chariot. I'm telling you, something is ending, changing, and transforming, and then there's that forward movement. Pisces, you may not know that someone is ending something and moving. Or you're doing this. You could be dealing with a Scorpio, a Cancer, a Libra. Give me more on this meeting with this mature man. This is a dis this is discussing and planning. What's going on with this mature man in this meeting? Four Swords. So Pisces, if this is a, dis a discussion that you've had with someone, Four Swords is they're thinking about it, right? Six of Wands. Yeah, someone's thinking about it, right? Someone could definitely be like. Because the Six of Wands could also be acknowledging it. Someone could be thinking like Pisces was right, right? Pisces was right. I definitely feel like there's a huge energy of strategizing. There's some sort of discussion here about how to heal or fix something or strategizing. There's definitely someone acknowledging something here. Yep, someone is having to come to terms with a disappointment, right? This mature man could literally be like, damn, I'm not going to get Pisces unless I come to her, right? I, we, like, we won't have this relationship unless I come to, to her, right? Yeah, because there's a queen of swords under here. Yeah, someone could definitely be leaving someone that they're in a, a long-term relationship with or a marriage. doesn't have to be for everybody. Some of you are definitely in that energy where you're seeking, like, a commitment and true, genuine love. And there's been some sort of conflict about this person coming towards you. I see a king of wands taking action, but he's stressed the hell out, having a lot of sleepless nights and anxiety about something. Let's see why denial and not facing a truth, irrational reasoning, marriage here. Like I said, it this, this, this doesn't have to be so nefarious. You could just simply be trying to get your partner to see the truth here, right? Because you could be doing arguing about a situation here, right? But let's see. So, but there could definitely be someone that was in denial about a union or a partnership that they were in, though, right? The tower, I'm telling you, that's the rose-colored glasses coming off. 
They can't be, something can't be denied anymore. That's why the tower is coming in. The tower is, uh, the tower is some shit you can't deny, right? The tower all, often also happens as well when we ignore and refuse to see certain things, right? Because the tower is built on a faulty foundation. And oftentimes we have tower moments because there's things that we simply refuse to see or we don't want to acknowledge or we don't want to accept. And then boom, you can't help it anymore. You have to, right? And that's what feels like what's happening here. Someone is no longer able to deny something about a marriage or a partnership here, right? But there's the Queen of Swords, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, the Hierophant. I'm telling you. Pisces, put yourself where you go because either this person knows that they got to come to you or they, or they like, because you could be this queen of swords, like what the fuck, right? For sure. Or someone is realizing that a marriage or a partnership that they're in is cold, right? And that they need to get out of it. Just put it where it goes. Yeah. Let's get some on this family, this blood ties, this inner circle, and then this wealthy man in exchange. There's a masculine energy here. He's, there's something going on with his money. There's getting ready to be change and movement. There could be a literal move here, Pisces. Like someone could not want to leave their family behind, right? And you don't want to leave your family behind, right? So how are we going to get together? Right? We can't be married in two different states or two different countries or two different continents, right? It could just be that simple for sure. But for others of you, this is somebody. There could be somebody that you ended it with because they didn't, they didn't want to see things for the truth about what they were in. They're seeing it now and they're making some sort of move, right? Pisces, for others of you, I see it could just be simple. Sim it could be as simple as a friend that's in a really bad situation here and they didn't want to see the truth about it, right? It could have literally been an intervention for some of you, like to wake someone up. I've had, you know, you know, if you know, you know, you know. Let's see what's going on with this wealthy man and this change here. Family for the baby sharks. Ten of Cups, I'm telling you, it's dealing with family. Still with family, nine of cups. There's definitely getting ready to be some sort of change, right? Someone could literally be getting themselves single or they're leaving a situation dealing with family to come to you to be together here, right? There is someone going after wish fulfillment because the ten of cups is the happy family, happy life, peaceful, stable environment where everyone is happy, right? But the nine of cups is an individual happiness here. So I feel like someone is making some sort of change here because they want to go after this ten of cups and they could also be making a change Dealing with a family in a living situation. Here's the moon. My Pisces, you could be dealing with another water sign for sure or a Gemini. But there is something boiling under the surface between you and a soulmate here. Yeah, and then there's this, there's a new spark coming in, Pisces. I have the nine of cups. Someone going after wish fulfillment. The moon tells me there's still mystery involved here. Someone could definitely be searching their emotions. Someone could be fantasizing about you, Pisces. Could be a Gemini. But I feel like there's this fantasy about this partnership. And then look, there's that Ace of Wands, that new spark. And there's that Ace of Cups, new love. Pisces, again, either someone is determined to come to you. Ooh, wee. I got the Queen of Wands, the Cherry, and the King of Wands. Either someone is determined to come to you now or you to them. Or someone is literally leaving a situation that they could, they cannot deny anymore. Whatever's happening here, Pisces, someone is not able to deny something anymore. The rose-colored glasses has, has come off, and now there's an energy of someone doing whatever they got to do, whether it's financial or otherwise, to make some sort of change. That's how I'm seeing it here, baby sharks. If I got it right for you, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and share. If you're interested in booking me, please email me. I love you guys. I appreciate all your continued support. I will be working on private reads today. Maybe I'll go live and do some quick Q&A. We never know. Just stay tuned. Make sure you hit the um, notification bell so you get notifications when I upload new videos. Also, comment any other signs you're interested in me doing in the comments, and I'll make sure, and I'll try to get to them today or tomorrow. But Aquarius is definitely on the board. Libra is on the board. Capricorn is on the board. Let me know if I'm missing anyone else. I love you guys. Take care of yourselves and your families, and I'll bring you messages soon. Bye, Pisces.